What's going on guys, Firewolf Tech here, showing you guys how to install the W-Scan camera lens protector for the iPhone 14 Pro or the Pro Max. This will be compatible for either or. Now earlier I had a camera lens protector that I installed for you guys, but as you can see it is completely cracked. And one of the major issues for this camera lens protector is that the protector itself is raised very high. So what happens is if I use a case, let's say like the Zag Gear 4 case, you can see that the bezels of the camera lens protector is almost sticking out a little bit higher than the actual bezels of this case. This case itself has a really high camera lens protector. So depending on the case you have, it might even be thinner. So this might stick out even more. So what happens is when you drop your phone, the camera lens protector will basically get chipped along the way. So as you can see, it basically started to chip on this portion right over here, as you can see. So yeah, so I broke the camera lens protector, unfortunately, but the good news is that the actual camera is fully protected. So what I did was I basically looked for another solution and this basically caught my eye. Um, now this is from WScan and what this is, is basically a camera lens protector, but without having that, you know, the high border this just basically just covers the actual lens itself so i'm going to show you guys how to put this on and see how it goes so it's going to come in this little uh, packet that you, that you see right here and inside you're going to get a cleaning wipe it's going to be dry and we have some dust removal stickers so what i'm going to do first is i'm going to take this old screen protector out sorry camera lens protector out okay perfect so as you can see, this camera lens protector is basically cracked really bad. So a lot of the camera lens protector that you're going to see online on Amazon, especially a lot of them are like this. They're going to basically be a very thick tempered glass that basically surrounds the whole camera layout. So I opted out for the graphite color. Now these come in other cool colors such as gold, purple, silver, even comes in a red color, purple, and a multicolor as well. So I'll link this in the description box below so make sure you guys check that out. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the cleaning wipe and we're just going to gently go across the top of the lens. And just to make sure there's no lint on top of the camera, I'm just gonna use one of these. All right, and now we're ready to install. So all we're gonna do is basically we're going to reveal the adhesive side. And this portion itself is gonna be an installation tool. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna line it up. And then you basically kind of feel where the actual camera lens is and then you just pop it in. And there's a little close up here. And you're gonna apply pressure. All right, and then there's an open piece over here. So let's hit open. And that's pretty much it really. You can see the camera lens protector here. So I opted out for the graphite. So if you want to match it, you can also choose a deep purple color. But I say, you know what? Let me just change it up a little bit. Um, that's a cool thing about these little lens protectors. So what I can see here is that there is no borders at all and it's just the lens itself that's basically covered. So I'm hoping that in the long run, this doesn't happen as you can see. Um, where this crack happened is on the top of this lens protector. And since this doesn't have a glass border, it's just a lens, I shouldn't have that problem because I use a really good case. And if you're using a really good case, you really don't have to worry about it. I don't see if you have a really good case, I don't even think a camera lens protector is worth it, but I'm gonna try this out and see how it fares in the long run. All right, so with the lens protector on, we're gonna test out the camera lens to make sure everything looks perfect. So I'm gonna take a picture of this broken lens protector here. And then we're gonna switch to the ultra wide camera. And then we're gonna use the telephoto camera as well. And as you can see here, the image is very, very clear. This is the ultra wide, and then this is the standard camera lens. So everything looks perfectly fine. Everything, all the details are retained. So again, I highly recommend the WScan camera lens protector. I really hope that this holds up well, and it should, because all it does is just pack, it basically just covers the camera lens itself. What do you guys think of this graphite color? I think it looks really nice with dark purple. If you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, guys.